Hi, I'm Miranda with Quest Health Solutions. Congratulations on receiving your new Dexcom G6 system. Now you can check your glucose with no finger sticks. The Dexcom G6 is a great tool for managing your diabetes, and it's extremely easy to use. In this video, I'm going to show you just how easy it is to get started with the Dexcom G6 app. You may pause this video at any time or replay any parts. To set up the app on your phone, first make sure you are using a compatible iPhone or Android device and double check that it is connected to the internet. Then go to the App Store or Google Play Store to search for and then download the Dexcom G6 app. Once the download is complete, tap the open button to launch the app. If you have created an account with Dexcom in the past, use that same username and password. If you have never created an account with Dexcom, go ahead and create an account. The app walks you through the entire setup process step by step. Let's get started. The first few screens provide information and videos. Watch these videos and read the information screens. You will come to a screen where you'll need to set your low alert. It's a good idea to set your low alert to a number that gives you time to react before your glucose gets too low. Once you set your low alert, tap save. Now set your high alert. You should work with your healthcare professional to determine which low and high alerts will be best for you. Next, you need to enter a sensor code. Your sensor code is on the sensor applicator. Once you enter the code, press confirm and your sensor is now connected. The next few screens walk you through connecting your transmitter to your phone. Your transmitter and phone connect using Bluetooth. The app automatically checks to see if your Bluetooth is on. Next, you need to enter your transmitter serial number. The serial number is on the back of your transmitter box. That's it for app setup. Now you'll need to insert your sensor and attach your transmitter. To insert your sensor, first choose a place on your abdomen. Choose a site at least three inches away from your insulin pump infusion set or injection site. Next, clean your skin with rubbing alcohol and let it dry. Grab the sensor you used during setup and remove both labels. Do not touch adhesive. Place the applicator on skin. Remove the safety guard. Fold and break it off. Press the button to insert sensor. Remove the applicator. You successfully inserted the sensor. You will wear each sensor for 10 days. Now it's time to attach your transmitter. Take your transmitter out of the box. Insert the tab of the transmitter into the slot on the transmitter holder. Snap the transmitter firmly into place. Rub around the patch three times. You've successfully attached your transmitter. You'll reuse the same transmitter for three months. Once your transmitter is attached, you can swim, bathe, and shower like normal. Now it's time to pair your transmitter and start your sensor. Wait for your transmitter to pair, then tap the Start Sensor button. Now your sensor warm-up has begun. The warm-up will take two hours to complete. After your two-hour warm-up, you get your first sensor glucose reading. Of course, if you have any questions during setup or any other time, call us at 1-800-301-4358, and one of our diabetes care advisors will be happy to assist you. Diabetes is complex. Managing your diabetes shouldn't be.